police are panicking. They are not trained. They should come to London and learn how to do it properly. In London, the police know what to do. These do not. It has never happened to them, so they are panicking. We were cycling today and we were back, coming back towards La Ramblas where we'd hide our cycles and we were in the street next to where we are now and we heard gunshots and people were running and screaming and we could see the police, obviously something serious was happening so um, a kind store owner let us into his shop and we hid under the counters and while we were in the, in the phone shop there was some poor German girl. She was obviously um, in total shock. She was shaking, she was crying. Um, she was just inconsolable. It was like, it's horrendous. We've had the same problem in the UK, yeah. Their children live in London, so they've seen it. They've like, but I mean, by the grace of God, we could have been here two minutes earlier and in it because walking to our hotel, we decided to take a a different route back and two minutes earlier we would have been on the street where it happened. Creo que nunca y espero que nunca más esté con este silencio de la rambla a estas horas. Y en las calles la gente, claro, que no sabemos por dónde pasar y todo el mundo en silencio. Es increíble, ni un grito, ni... ni... La gente creo que llora en silencio, me da muchísima pena, muchísimo. Creo que son muy impactantes todas las imágenes que vimos y no estamos nadie preparado. La policía lloraba y es que yo he estado, o sea, así, aquello que te, te impacta, ¿no? Porque te parecen tan fuertes, tan... pero creo que nadie está preparado. Pero me conmovió que, que policías se secaran las lágrimas. Es muy fuerte. Es lamentable. Para allá.